Well, hello there. I'm the old growler. Welcome to Meeting Expectations. What we do here is we take a look at a can of beer, a bottle of beer sometimes, a wine or a spirit might drop by. We're all friends in fermentation. Uh, we take a look at the label. We read everything on the label. We check out the artwork. We see what they're trying to sell us. We crack it open and see if it meets expectations. First of all, all beers should be served at the correct temperature. Lagers between 37 and 47 degrees Fahrenheit and ales between 50 and 55 degrees Fahrenheit. I use <coughs> a Thermoworks pen to test the temperature of all of my beers. There is a link in the description box below if you are interested. Also, we always use the same glassware for all of our tastings. That way nobody has a leg up when it comes to clarity or aromatics. And finally, when most people do a tasting, they will look, they will sniff, they will sip, and they will pontificate. Well, <coughs> I'll pontificate, all right, but <coughs> I'll sip first. Why? I'll let wine expert Fred Dax explain it all to you. He does a lot better than I do. All right, what do we got today? Okay, from the folks in Brattleboro, Vermont, we have got Hermit Thrush Brewery, Party Guy, Kettle Soured Session Ale. All right. We harness local wild cultures with local hops to create fresh and bright kettle sour ales. Brewed and canned by Hermit Thrush Brewery, 29 High Street, 101C, Brattleboro, Vermont, 05301. Uh, the government warning that I should not operate heavy machinery or be a pregnant woman. It says to please recycle. 437 milliliters, one pint. Uh, the Brewers Association certify them as an independent craft brewer. Okay, Party Guile, G-Y-L-E. Brew packs in flavor but keeps it crushable. S soured with native lactobacillus. And it is 3% alcohol by volume, $5.99 at the local beer barrel. All right, what are we looking for? A kettle soured session ale. Well, it's certainly light on the alcohol, that's for sure. But three percent, so that this is a this is a session beer, that's for sure. A sour session beer, and it has got uh, uh, some kind of uh, local hops. So it's going to be it, it's going to be an interesting. It's going to be a sour beer, an interesting sour beer, maybe a little bit uh, cloudy, but we'll crack it open and see if it meets those expectations. Well, it's not cloudy, okay. That's, that's got surprised, but pleasantly surprised. Wow, I can smell it from here. That's got a sour smell, that's for sure. It's a gorgeous looking beer. <coughs> Ale. Clocking in at 48 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's uh, probably a little chilly, but we'll give it benefit of the doubt. That mainly has to do with the aromatics, letting the ar more of the aromatics out or the flavors develop. Oh, as I said, I, I could smell this. This is a very interesting aroma to begin with, but <coughs> Let's see, it looks like a, a sour beer. Let's see if it tastes like a sour beer. Whoa. <laughs> Most of the times I take two sips because my taste buds are asleep. But boy, they got woke right away. Whoa. Well, let's see what their old factory friends have to say. I'm getting a lot of uh, combination of lemon and grapefruit on that one. Well, let's see what the taste buds have to say after <coughs> the consulting with their old factory friends. Ah, wow. That is, this is not for beginners. No, uh, uh, uh. this isn't for beginners. This is definitely a sour. As far as a session sour, though, 
Yeah, as, as far as the alcohol content goes, yeah. But um, I don't think I'm going to be drinking three or four of these. Uh, not at one time. No siree, Bob. This is this is a sipping beer, and I would probably I would love to have a piece of sharp cheddar cheese to go with this, or or even better, uh, some chevre, some goat cheese. That would that would that would help this out an awful lot. <clears throat> but as far as describing on the label, does uh, Hermit Thrush Brewery, Brattleboro, Vermont, Party Guy, Kettle Soured Session Ale meet expectations? It nailed it on the head. It certainly did. If you enjoyed this presentation, please click on the subscribe button and the bell. That way you won't miss any of our presentations. A comment would be appreciated. Thumbs up would be great. And share us with your friends. A comment would be really appreciated. I'm Pete LaFrance, the old growler, hoping all of your beers meet expectations.